So I got I got a question. I always had this question. Okay. I used to ask Dre this, so Dre would just be like, oh, yeah. right? Shout out and, Dre, man, Gucci Dre. And keep, keep it real, because Statue of Limitations is up, right? Mm -hmm. So I used to see y'all, uh, <laughs> I, I used to see y'all, and we, we were in college. I, I think I graduated at the time, mm -hmm. but I used to see you around, and I'm like, how are these niggas doing this Because I knew what I was doing, but like, bro, it's drippy in the And then I would go to the club, <laughs> and I was like, bro, how the f are these young having bottles and sections, and I'm like four years older, and I don't even have a bottle, or I've never even had a bottle before, and I'm like, what the f are y'all doing? And I used to see y'all all the time, and I was like, okay, you does Photoshop or something. I'm like, nah. nah. I'm like, bro, what the hell is going on? T tell, what was going on, brother? All right. <laughs> All right, for me, yeah. I was an assistant manager at Lids at Linux. Okay. And I also had an internship with Dell. I was a computer specialist at Dell. Oh, okay. So yeah, the job. Send me out, yeah. Okay. They were sending me to different schools and stuff like that. And I was the person that hooked up all the computers and put them all on one system. So I was making like really good money at that intern. Mm. And then I was the manager at Lids. And then while I was at Lids, I used to order snapbacks from overseas and I would sell them mm. inside my job. So I was literally running it up in Liz too, like on top of working at Liz, okay. on top of working this job. So like, and then I was doing my music at the time too. Okay. So people was paying me for features. Okay. I was doing shows. So I was getting booked. So <laughs> all of that. Yeah. But on top of that, I also was a party promoter at the time. Uh, okay. So I linked up, I linked up with, um, I linked up with uh, my boy, Mr. Plush. And he was putting me on parties and shit like that. So, and like, Mr. Flesh. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, he still do parties and shit. So, like, bruh had brought me on. It was like me, me and Dorsey were like his two young niggas at the time. Yeah. So, like, I was doing like all the parties that he were doing, and then like we was promoting them. Then Fadia brought me on to do Broken Bougie. So, like, I was doing parties too, getting paid as a promoter as well. And then a part of my deal with him is like, yo, I gotta have a section. We gotta have this amount of bottles. Man. And, we'll, and we'll come in here and buy bottles too because I'm a rapper. Yeah. I need my look to be right. And I need to be tapped in with the DJ that's in there. So I need my song played every night I'm in here. Yeah. So I just use Man, all, all my resources to my advantage. You know what's so crazy is for, so from the outside looking in, so I'm in the streets at the time. And yeah. I'm just like, I'm not hating at all, but I'm just like, <laughs> I gotta be doing better. And the whole time you niggas was legal with jobs and shit. And I'm out here. I was it. saying everyone was legal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was legal. Yeah, yeah, yeah I know. I'll keep that. I used to be like, what the f? I had niggas trapping around me yeah, too. Yeah. You know, so shit. Okay. Yeah. Then, well, you laugh because people ask you that? Yeah, I get that. I get asked that all the time. Okay. I either hear like, oh, his parents rich, or I get here, I get told like, oh, he was trapping. Mm. So, 